Hello YouTube! Kagamo here, back in Broken Age, and uh... Uh, no, I did have to look up uh, hints on how to get the snake. <laughs> but uh, the solution is just so out there, you can't, aren't gonna think of it. It's another one of those things where you have to just wait. For a solution to take care of itself. Stupid. Hello again, old friend. That must have been danger. I was snowing. Feel like letting go of me, Mr. Huggy? <gasps> wow. Oh, you really aren't kidding around, are you? You're actually trying to squeeze the life out of me, aren't you? I love it! So, is your plan to kill me? Then eat me? Okay, I uh, think it's making <clears throat> dead. Oh, that was a good one. Uh, well, this has been fun, but... <sighs> I, I had better be going soon. Okay, fun time's over, my scaly friend. I... Oh, I hope you're not bending my friend's spoon. He sounds fine. Mm. I remember reading on the ship's Cosmomnipedia that snakes hate loud noises. I don't want to have to resort to sonic violence, Mr. Huggy, but it's time to let go now. Oh. Uh, seriously, you better let go. Not kidding around, Mr. Huggy. I think it won't be much longer now. <sighs> I guess that poor snake didn't realize how many hug attacks I've been through. Mr. Huggy's all tuckered out. Don't want to leave him here where someone might step on him. So just put the snake in your pocket. That's fine. I'm not making a joke. I know you're all thinking the joke, but I'm not making Hurry up and pan out, thank you. Oh, hey, you had something caught in your throat. Oh. Hey, knock that off, Mr. Huggy. Back to your tree. Mug, Mug Chatra. Struck down by the dead eye god, only to rise again. This maiden's feast was a disaster. I'm never gonna be mayor now. Okay, now that you're done with that, uh, put your pipe. Yeah. Do you know how to build a superconductive gyroscopic hypercam? I can build anything, as long as it's made out of sand. I don't think sand is going to stick together enough. Once upon a time, I would agree with you. But I recently met a mysterious young woman who gave me a secret ingredient. I don't think sand is superconductive. If it can't be made with sand, it's not worth making at all. Excuse me? Huh? Who are you? Marshal Du. Who are you? I'm Shay, from Laruna. Laruna? You're from the ancient lost city far beyond the Plague Dam? Huh. Well, that's not exactly how it was described to me. Can you tell me where we are? Why, the village of Shell Mound, of course. The eighth largest incorporated seaside territory on the whole East Coast. Really, the eighth 
Largest. Do you know how to build a superconductive gyroscopic hypercam? I can build anything. As long. I think sand is the perfect material for making spaceship parts. But can you make something this complicated? Please, do you realize to whom you are speaking? And that's why they call me Marshal Dew. Thanks. No, thank you, son, for reminding me why I got into this business. I might look like a politician, but underneath it all, I'm just a guy who loves sand. Ooh, that's good. I'm going to pass that along to my speechwriter. His beard is scaly. It's a gyroscopic hypercam. If only it weren't made out of sand. I know how to fix that. I'm just gonna put this here, okay? Hey, the forest isn't your dumping ground, human. Hey, do you know this girl? Oh god, that face! The memories! <laughs> Every bit as cruel as her, aren't you? <laughs> the sap hardened into a perfect, albeit gross looking, mold for a hypercam. Hey, Curtis, do you think you could use this as a mold? Hmm. Hey, this is a nice mold. What is this, a candle holder? It's a super... Because candle holders sell like crazy. I can totally use this as a mold if it's a candle holder. It's a super candle holder. Cool. Let's try it out. Hit the road, kitty. Please don't be a cat. Please don't be a cat. That's perfect. You think it conducts electricity really well? Well, not that it matters for a candle holder, but based on the metals I'm using, yes. Thanks. Yeah, you take the first one. Fair trade for this awesome mold that is gonna make me so rich. Uh, which <clears throat> I only care about because it gives me the freedom to be truer to myself as an artist. Thanks, Curtis. Pleasure doing business. I mean, art with you. Can I take the kitty? No. Okay. You know, when he asked for a super conductive gyroscopic copper cam, I didn't think it would just be a lump of metal in that specific shape. Feeling the superconductive, but not the gyroscopic hypercamminess of it. Here you go, one superconductive gyroscopic hypercam as requested. Hey, that looks even better than my old one. This faux sandy texture really adds to the conductive surface area. Brilliant! Oh yeah, yeah. that's a really recent advancement in hypercams. Well thanks Shay, that about does it. Get Is hyper there anything left for me to do? Just sit here and wait for your dad to patch the hull, and then we'll take off. How long do you think that will take? Hey, I waited 300 years for this. We can wait a few more minutes. <sighs> through this door my dad used? Oh, you don't want to go down there yet. Very unsafe. Many sublevels are structurally unsound. Who knows if the air is breathable? 
Plus, there are some rogue automatons I've yet to get under control. Why didn't you warn my dad about that stuff? Didn't you see the look in his eyes? I knew there was no stopping him. Did you forget? I don't know how to tune that. Pipe. Hey, that song that makes your space conductor return to his last port? Could you play it for me? On this? Well, I can try. Oh, that's catchy. I think if you're a mid navigation mid. computer, that's actually a pretty hot note. High, low, mid. It looks like some sort of musical star chart. Mid, mid, high, low, mid. Right. Hey, can you play that previous destination song for me again? See? So this I is the thing I need for Vela. Mid, mid, high, low, mid. No problem. Good practice for me. I'm going to need it. Better not go too far. Alex might take off without me. It's a robot charging station. Look at him go! This old-fashioned wiring must seem so primitive to him. Hey, in my day we got by just fine without any fancy seats. How about now? Nope. Still nothing to do but wait for your dad. <sighs> okay, see you later. Okay. Yeah, I haven't gone that long, so I guess... Can't do anything but shift over to Bella. See what she's up to. Hey, you got this old timey laser coil and amplifying quartz all hooked up wrong. Want me to? No, no, don't touch them. They've come close to overheating several times and they're extremely unstable. I'll, I'll get around to fixing that soon. Just leave it to me. All right, all right. This door, my dad. I don't know how to tune that. Looks like a pitch pipe. Don't see anything there I want to eat. I don't know how to tune that. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to. I don't know what the bell is because I don't really have a video yet. High, low, mid. With pleasure. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Intake calibers in position. I don't think anyone would mind. High, high velocity. low, mid. Spindle at rotational velocity. Deploying nav scarf in five. Four. Three. She doing? What do you think you're doing? You're just in time. Marikai is leaving the ship. Look, there he goes. Is everything else ready? I baked the cake and put it in the oven. Great. Then let's get out of here. Thank you for getting my baking reference. Drive thread engaged. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm Inhibited. I'm beautiful. 
boy! That happened. I can. Okay. Well, I couldn't patch everything, but the main living areas should hold together now. Well then, that means this ship is ready to fly to Laruna. How about you guys? I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Stop. You aren't going anywhere. Who are you guys? Bella's family. We've been talking to people. And we've connected some dots. When Mog Chothra ate my sister, he barfed you up. Please tell us where our daughter is. She's... She's gone beyond the plague dam. And we're all going after her. Who's we? It sounds like all of us. Yeah, um, I had already initiated launch. But, um, nice to meet you guys. I'm a friend of your daughter's. Jedi God has truly risen and exposed a Clarence? whole new segment of beachfront property for development. Looks like this day turned out okay after all. He doesn't like mayoral material. So you got them going left, them going right. Something tells me we've arrived. Wow. So, what do we do now? Honk or something? Time to see if the ship's communication system still works. Hello. Uh, ahoy! This this is the star or airship Malaruna requesting re-entry. Um, I've been gone a long time, but if you could just open the door, we'll come in and explain. Alex, I don't think that's going to. Oh, never mind. Look at that. Yes. Oh, wait a second. What's that? Dad, is that? That's our ship. You think Mom's on board? Brace yourself! You hit them! Hey, we're all on autopilot. But look, since we're so close, I'll extend our gangway and you can use it to go say hi. It's way too short. What, you're afraid of a little jump? What? They're firing at her! Quick, back up! Let them get out of range! I told you, autopilot. Well, do something! Okay, everybody be quiet. I need to think. Think faster. Oh, okay, that's... Hey, I think that ship... I think it belongs to my friend Alex. I can't believe he got that thing running. Well, go around it then. We're under fire. I would love to, Captain Volta. But you know, once the path is woven, the ship follows only the thread. It's out of my control. We are going to get blown to bits. Surely the ship's shields will protect us. Well, that's hard to say. Ship's shields. Ship's shields. There are no ship shields. We threw the fusion orb out the trash chute. Excuse me? What protocol calls for the disposal of our... There is no protocol for this situation. This is... no territory here, okay? My advice is to just sit back and enjoy the trip. I am only asking you to steer a few hundred yards left or right 
just for a bit. Even if it were in my power, Captain, that kind of navigational sloppiness is a slippery slope. I am about to come down there and unplug you! You can unravel me like a sweater, but it won't change the course we're on. The nav scarf has been deployed. But I can take manual control of the ship. Not when I am following the commands of a star chart. That's ridiculous! I don't make the rules. Well, who does? The rules were here before either of us. It's not our job to question them. <sighs> we're doomed. Okay, let's see what's happening over here with Shay. I didn't realize that was the selection screen. Character selection screen. Shooting. You said this was your home. People, this is just some sort of misunderstanding. I've been gone 300 years. Give them a break, okay? As soon as I figure out the hailing frequency, I'll tell them who I am and we'll all be laughing about this. I hope you're right, Alex. Oh, it's a microphone. Hello? Hello? Looks like someone soldered these parts in place. Ah, their casings must have melted together in the heat. Now I couldn't take them apart if I wanted to. Trust me, if a girl ever asks you to make her a death ray, say no. And she's dancing with the robot. Anybody there? Okay. Hello? See what's behind this Can door. Can go through this door my dad used? Oh, you don't want to go down there yet. Very unsafe. Many sub-levels are structurally unsound. But who knows if the air's breathable? Plus, there's some rogue auto... This is the Dandelion Cruiser, Malaguna. Hey, Alex? Not now, Shay. I need to get through to someone who can get us out of this mess. Just to go over it one more time, you guys are totally clear that I wasn't kidnapping maidens on purpose, right? Yes, yes, we know, Shay. It's a lot to take in. But I think we get the general picture. We'll give you a pass for now. But when I see my sister again, she better back up your story. Okay, grunted. We're outside the gate, requesting entry. I don't think there's anything I can do here my right name's now. Alex, I've been gone like a long time. Please answer. Well, go around it then. We're Alex's pyramid really looks like it's going to melt down soon. I would love to, Captain Volta. But hey, mind if I... Oh, please don't touch those. I control all the ship's systems from here. I just wanted to blow up the ship, because that's one of the things you can do there. Oh. No, I don't want to do that. Never mind. Are you sure? It's out of my control. We are going to get blown to bit! Oof. Burbies. These big surveillance screens don't seem to be working. This scrap wire might come in handy if I wanted to repair something. Fire. Marakai, where are you? What caused that explosion? Uh, oh, there's the big sorry. ugly. Wrong number. How do I turn this off? You? What's happened to Marakai? <laughs> Can you be more specific? Which part of him are you looking for? You. Violent abomination. I'm starting to see why Marakai was so taken with you. Thank you. You. Why do you pretend these ships are in space? Several of our first parent teams, upon witnessing the Badlands, succumbed to their pull and settled there forever. Obviously, the frightening visuals drove them mad. So now, we protect them. 
stop shooting at us and let us go. You're a terrorist, and you will face justice. Plus, we still need you, Vela. What do you need me for? To true the formation in our bloodline. Is truing the formation as creepy as it sounds? We nurtured I think so, yeah. and our bloodline for hundreds of years, removing impurities, and built the plague dam to keep them out forever. Unfortunately, it turns out that some of those impurities were necessary. So, as we have become refined, we've also become somewhat delicate. We are a house made out of fine crystal, but we still need rocks and clay for the foundation. That's where you come in. Please, excuse me. I need to go end your entire way of doing things. You'll never... That's the button that turns it off. This door must have jammed shut in the collision. I could get to where I could see the plague wall, I could just use the death ray. That's not the part that's shooting at us. Bleak. This one's not opening either. Do I need to use the head thingy? Can I use the head thingy? No, I might not. Surely the nope. shields will protect us. Can't use the head thingy. Just when you think you've taken care of them all, another one shows up. Guess I'd better eliminate these two before they breed. Oh, that was bad. Rats. This one's rats. This one's not opening either. There is no protocol for I wonder, if I messed with this navigation scarf some more, would it get us out of this jam? What do you mean, some more? Oh, I meant, uh, for the first time. Would that change our course? No. The scarf has already been fed into the navigation system. It will heed no nit nor pearl until we reach that destination. But please, don't touch it. That's a very sensitive part of the system. No, I think the Space Weaver would feel it. Only for a little while. My advice is to just sit back and enjoy the... He trip. said don't touch it. It's very sensitive. Leaving this wire in wouldn't change anything. I am only asking you to steer a few hundred yards left or right just for a bit. Even if it were in my... I think Lorraine has this under control. Yep, I'm on it. Really? He's still talking. Ugh. Down there and hey, you're steering the ship, right? Can you get us out of here? I am but the leader of the pack. The ship controls itself. You won't budge a little to the left or right? We'll die if you don't! Well, now I'm just full of anxiety. How does that help? <sighs> you can unravel me like a sweater, but it will change. Let's hope that big open window makes for better reception. Darn! Didn't hit anything! What the? 
How did that... Bella. Her hot-headedness is gonna get us all killed. It's already too hot to touch. I'm gonna have to kill the circuit in the power room. Stay here. There are some, uh, legacy features of the ship down below that can be unpredictable. Okay. How'd this thing get set again? Oh, come on! We were this close to a real meltdown. Quit being such a fraidy cat, Alex. Let's see if Shay can do anything right now. Oh. Can't use that door, so... It's down here! Oh, hey, son. Dad! What are you doing here? Uh, just patching up a few more holes. Seems like every time I fix one... Oh! Gotta go! Looks like part of the old ship controls. There's a decayed old logbook here. Music morgue. Empty slot there for it. Damn. Someone stole the drum mallet. I could have really made some noise with that thing. Don't see anything there I want to eat. Still sounds drummy. still kind of intact. Maybe with the right musician it could still sound great. Don't see anything there I want to eat. Hey, looks like a radio. Hmm, like a broken radio. Such a shame. This is what happens when you don't take care of your instruments for 300 years. Up, it would disintegrate. Triangle empty, triangle empty, triangle. Up, down, triangle, up, down. Dad? Did you see something? What? Another breach? No, not exactly. Oh, good. Because I have enough to worry about up here. They have square fellas. There. Hello. Are you guys from the old ship? Have you been down here 300 years? All alone? Actually, diamond. Whoa. So, would you mind if I just scooted Trump by into off. the. Hey, 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 okay. All right. You don't want me in there. Okay. That's cool. I got other stuff to do. working. Don't see anything there I want to eat. Hello? Hello? Anybody there? Hey, little Hexapal. You still have some electrical geniusness deep in there somewhere? Sorry. She's all about the rhythm now. Hey! Well, look at that. His tinkering must be wired in on a deeper level. And he's already done. Still, better come with me. Aww. <laughs> I 
Oh, he's so happy! <laughs> he's all juiced up now, but I guess a little top off couldn't hurt. Okay, I'm gonna close this off here. My name's Alex. Yeah, I've been gone a fair ways there. A long time. Got back to it. Please answer. Sort of together. But uh. Mayday. Mayday. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Just hey, for now, I am leaving it here. Not sure how much more of the game there is, but I'll worry about that when we come to it. So, gonna be saying adios, happy to say, aloha, all that good stuff. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It's not hard. And until next time, uh, remember to turn off your diamond pals before you go into stasis, because otherwise they go all indigenous, or however you want to put that. Still, it's a very inventive use for a xylophone there. Yeah.